Hello, I'm Dr. Andrew Slavin. What I'd like to discuss with you today is dental implants and three-dimensional imaging. From a patient standpoint, it's very important that you have three-dimensional imaging if you're planning to have implants placed in your jaw bones. There's critical structures in your lower jaw bone and your upper jaw bone which can get damaged during implant surgery. With three-dimensional imaging, it allows more predictable results with less invasive procedures. What I'd like to show you today is this image of a patient's lower jawbone. And as we can see, this tooth is a problem tooth that needs to be removed. And this implant can be placed virtually on the screen. And the nerve which runs through the jawbone, that's actually numbed when you have a shot of Novocaine that makes your lip numb, is a critical structure that the implant has to be shorter than this to allow you not to have damage to that nerve. We can see this implant in three dimensions as we can the tooth and the nerve. Equally as important is this scan of the upper jawbone which clearly delineates the borders of the maxillary sinus which is an air cavity. As we can see here if we put our implants, implants in virtually we can see that they would protrude into the sinus. We wouldn't know this without a three-dimensional scan. If the implants are placed and puncture your sinus you're going to end up with a communication into your sinus which will cause you to have fluid leak from your nose when you drink fluids and you can end up with a massive sinus infection which would require several days or several weeks of treatment as well as surgery to correct the problem. So it's imperative that you have a three-dimensional scan of the upper jawbone just like with the lower jawbone to avoid these critical structures. The three-dimensional imaging that we do is done right here in our office. It only takes a few minutes and a few minutes longer to interpret the results. It's complementary, it's site specific, it's minimal radiation. The bottom line is, is that three dimensional imaging, just like other procedures that we do, allow us to minimize risk and maximize benefits in your implant therapy and related surgeries. It's another tool in our armamentarium which allows us to 